Hey everyone and welcome to the newbies and welcome back to those who are returning subscribers. In today's video, I have something special planned for you guys. Something really, really special that I wanted to do that required its own video. So today we are going to go into uh, particular personal care items that are a little bit less expensive than some of the ones I mentioned in my previous videos. So if you guys have not had an opportunity to watch any of my previous videos, I did one that discussed um, the summer essentials that are essential for me specifically as a pregnant lady. So if you have not gotten an opportunity to take a look at that video, go ahead and look at that. And as soon as you're done looking at that one, go ahead and take a look at the other video that actually talks about how I use these items. So this video will list everything that you need in order to see what items I use in my routine. And this one will show you exactly how I use these items and maybe give you an idea of what you can do to either create or improve your self-care routine. In this particular video, I did buy some new products because I wanted to be able to um, not only share with you guys inexpensive products that I purchased at Family Dollar, Dollar General, and Dollar Tree, but I wanted to be able to review these items in depth so that way you guys don't just hear what I'm telling you, but you actually see the work in action, right? Because I feel like if you're going to talk about items, you need to be able to have the experience of having used them. Also, real quick before we get into the video, really, really quick, if you guys are wondering where I got this shirt, it does say I'm the baby mama. Um, in my Instagram post so many moons ago, when we shared our pregnancy announcement, I did wear this shirt and my husband did wear the baby daddy shirt. And my husband, he just happens to be the CEO of the IJST store, which stands for I'm Just Saying Though. He has a lot of great items on that website. A lot of, lot of awesome shirts that have really cool sayings on them and they're really inexpensive. So... If you have some time, just feel free to go ahead and check out the site for yourself and you can see all the cool shirts that are on there. I'm gonna go ahead and get started on these lists for you. And because I visited three different stores, I broke down the products by each store. And I'm gonna start off with the, the store that is like the most expensive to the least expensive. So I'm gonna need y'all to stay with me if y'all wanna know about these deals. I have a really great secret for you guys that I've saved until the end of the video. So you kinda gotta watch till the end of the video so you can see what it is. But I guarantee you, you want to stay tuned because for, any, for anyone that values really good products at a really great price, this secret is gonna be everything. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we're gonna start with Family Dollar first, okay? The turban that I'm wearing, I actually got from Family Dollar and it was $2. So uh, if you are feeling like your hair is like jacked up and you like, you kind of want to look cute, but you really don't want to like do anything with your hair, this is a really great alternative. I'm currently in that situation. Um, I did not wash my hair today, but I did kind of gel it up a little bit, got these edges together, put on this $2 turban that I got from Family Dollar, put some earrings with it, some lipstick and a cute shirt, and now I'm popping, right? Cause you did not want to see me how I was looking earlier. Cause I was looking like completely unkept. Next, we're going to talk about the Nivea Lip Care Milk and Honey, and I got this for $2. I actually have it on now, but you cannot tell because I put my matte lipstick over it. And the reason why I did that was because I really don't like the clear glossy look. I like the fact that I was actually able to put this on and then put a matte over it and it still doesn't come through glossy, like it's still matte. But my lips feel super nourished, I'm not even going to lie to you, my lips are really, really nourished right now. Like, I feel like it's amazing. For the record, I do currently use Blistex, and I mean, Blistex is cool and everything, but I gotta be honest with you, they don't hold a candle to Nivea. And so that's just where it's at. This is in the milk and honey flavor, and it just smells like, it smells like a honeycomb. Like, do honeycomb smell? And for those of y'all that do not know, I am currently 33 weeks along so um yeah we can't stay too long in stores because we walking around looking crazy and waddling around like a penguin so that being said i had to quickly move over to the dollar general where i wanted to try something different and i want to get you guys' opinion on something real quick so i'm gonna show you what i'm talking about so i got the vaseline intensive care calm healing with lavender ex extracts and I got this specifically because I wanted to experiment. 
I've been self-diagnosing myself. I just want y'all to know that. And I've been dealing with like what I believe is restless leg syndrome. For those of you who may not be familiar with that, it's like a super annoying characteristic that happens specifically in second and third trimesters uh, with pregnant women. It is a common thing to my understanding, but like when you're trying to sleep, basically your legs want to cha-cha. And um, that is really annoying when the rest of your body is tired and you can't sleep because your legs won't let you. It's like this really weird feeling where your legs are just kind of like all over the place and you just, you, know, you gotta kind of make do with it, but you can't sleep until your legs settle down. It's so weird, it's so uncomfortable. And instead of spending $30 on a cream that is specific for restless leg syndrome, I wanted to try something with lavender to see whether or not it would actually help calm me down. I know it sounds really crazy, it probably sounds super elementary, but you know what? I wanted to give it a shot. And any day of the week, I would rather spend $3.50 on a lotion than $30. So I wanted to give it a shot and see if it worked. I've only tried it for two nights. I'm here to tell y'all that so far, so good. So I'm just saying, this might be a breakthrough video for y'all pregnant ladies. You know, we might be on to something, I don't know, but it's only been two nights. It's only been two nights. I'm gonna try it and I'm gonna let y'all know. And we're gonna talk about this in the future. I'm gonna put a pin in this. We're gonna talk about this in the future. We have not forgotten about this. And in case you are curious, it does smell like lavender and eucalyptus, but not super strong, which I can appreciate. Okay, so now we're gonna get a little personal because that's just what we do. Um, we are going to talk about this feminine wash that I received from Dollar General, or that I purchased at Dollar General. This is the Studio Selection Feminine Wash. I did use this. I actually used this a couple of times. First of all, one thing I can appreciate about this versus Summer's Eve, Summer's Eve will be like, oh, it's fragrance-free, or da-da-da, and that mug is not fragrance-free. It is a light fragrance, and they just won't, like, be honest about the situation. I'm like, listen, when y'all say fragrance free, I'm gonna need y'all to mean fragrance free. So Summer's Eve, I can't get with. And that's a name brand product. But see, not all name brand products work in that sense. They just don't really work for you like that. They definitely don't work for my behind. But um, this one from Studio Selection from Dollar General, this is uh, so far so good. I will go ahead and give you too much information. So if you wanna know this too much information, stay tuned. If you don't, go ahead and skip forward about 30 seconds because I'm about to tell you something that is a little too much information. Um, but uh, I am uh, <laughs> pleased to say that this feminine wash actually works very well for both the front and back doors. I told you we were gonna get personal. And the good thing about this is, is that it does not sud up down there. Um, it is just, it's a nice, clear, fragrance-free, truly fragrance-free liquid that you can use down there and it pretty much just washes on and washes off. And by the time you're done, it doesn't leave any residue. There's no no liquidy feeling. It doesn't feel weird. It's just, feel you just feel clean. So that's what that is. Here comes some interesting finds from the Dollar Tree. So from the Dollar Tree, I did purchase a facial mist, which normally I do not do a lot of facial mists. Um, but in this instance, I wanted to try something because the packaging looked kind of cool. So I got this, um, the company's name is, excuse me, Bolero, and this is in the coconut and rose milk scent. This is the facial mist. It hydrates, nourishes, and soothes. This little sucker, it doesn't look like much, but it's actually pretty interesting. I have like normal to dry skin, and I felt like, I earlier I did like a, um, I did a mask. Afterwards, I did use this, and this is actually quite soothing. Felt like it wasn't as hydrating, maybe as what it, how it's advertised to be, but it smells really good. It smells almost like a little coconut. Um, was it like a coconut? What is it? <laughs> coconut lotion type of situation, and it's just it's refreshing. Also made the um, hydrating and cleansing facial wipes in watermelon and aloe. And so I did get a chance to try this. I thought that for a dollar, this is pretty cool. The scent is spot on. Watermelon aloe is exactly what it smells like. The texture of the wipes are very thick, which is surprising for a dollar's worth. I thought they'd be super thin, like they'd be like just tearing up as you're using it. Well, I don't necessarily see that as this as my last time purchasing these, but I will tell you, 
I will probably wind up going with these. The Equate brand that I have shown you guys before in, a pre in previous videos. And um, it's just because I really like these. These are rose water cleansing tablets. The scent on these are actually a lot stronger than these. And I just tend to prefer the scent of these more so than these guys. So now we're going to talk about these charcoal cleansing nose strips. Now here's something interesting. The funny thing is if you look at the packaging, does it or does it not resemble Biore? If you pick this up at Dollar Tree, you might actually think you're getting Biore, but you're not. Here's the gotcha. You are getting a quality product that is similar to Biore. And I'm keeping it all the way real. I used this earlier and I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. This is everything. Now, it was a little bit difficult for me to use it because I do have a nose ring. But when I tell you it took everything out of my nose and it was trying to take my nose ring out too. This right here is the junk y'all. If you suffer with blackheads or you know big pores or anything like that, go ahead and do yourself a favor and pick this up. This actually comes with two nose strips and only takes like 10 minutes of your time. Go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. You'll thank yourself. And I'm actually like, I'm over here like, yo, when I go back to Dollar Tree, I'm getting this because this is bomb. I wouldn't even put it in my video if it wasn't unless I really just wanted to talk shit about it. I'm going to go ahead and insert some pictures here so that way you guys can see um, what my experience was with these particular nose strips. I'm not gonna show you what it pulled off because that was disgusting, but just take my word for it. And you have nothing to lose, it's only a dollar. Remember when I told y'all earlier in the video that I have a surprise for you guys, for you ladies especially? So let me go ahead and tell y'all something. Y'all are not gonna believe me. Now we ladies are all familiar with this brand, okay? We are all, maybe not all of us are familiar with the scents, but we're definitely familiar with the brand. And when I tell y'all, I'm not joking. Found these at Dollar Tree, okay? I found these at Dollar Tree for a dollar. Now these are a dollar probably because these bars are 90 grams as opposed to the original size bars that I believe are 135 grams. So of course that's where the price difference is because you don't get as much product, but yo, a dollar for Dove? And these are this is like real Dove. This is not like, oh, you look on the back of it and you know, it's it's you know, written in Chinese. Like this is real, this is all English. This is <laughs> this is like the real Dove. I just wanted to go ahead and share that with you guys in case you guys do not know the Dollar Tree is coming up on their game, y'all. They are coming up with Dove. So I mean, you can't you can't lose. And if you guys are not picking up some of these items from Dollar Tree specifically, you guys are missing out because there are some really great finds there and I really don't want you guys to miss out on these goodies. That is everything that I wanted to show you guys. I really hope and pray that you guys found this video super helpful and you guys will really really rethink about going to some of these stores and, and finding some of your favorite products in these stores and even giving new brands a try. So, like I said, you know, don't judge a book by its cover because I used to do that too. And then when I went and I challenged myself to get these items, I really was surprised. So, if you found this video helpful at all, at all, please do not be afraid to go ahead and like this video for me. Let YouTube know that it was that I was super helpful to you. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell notification so that way you'll be notified of any new videos that I post. And if you just happen to have any other chicas looking for any valuable information such as this, go ahead and share this video. Don't worry about it, I won't be mad. Again, I wanna thank you guys so much for taking the time to watch this video and experience these new finds with me. I'm really excited to have been able to share this stuff with you. You guys have an awesome day and I will see you in the next video. Bye.